Surya has rained yesterday night. Okay, so it is little bit. See here, it is wet. Little bit wet, not that wet. Little bit moisture is there. So now you are going to bat. Okay, and it is very overcast also. There is no sun. So yes. naturally, the wicket is the pitch has little bit moisture in it. There is no sun, so the ball will swing. It will keep low. Okay, so all those things will happen, and it will be challenging for you as a batter. So in the time lag during this situation, what will be the basics that you will follow? How will your batting game plan be? If your side has lost early wickets, and you are going to bat in at say thirty for four, thirty for five, how will you play? Playing close to the body. Close to the body. Okay, uh, that's a good one because the ball will be keeping low. It is best to play close. And what about the areas? and trying to aim in the v okay front of the wicket any specific reason for that yeah we level or no because already the ball, ball is coming very at, uh, at a low pace low pace and, and also skid okay so a ball is keeping low yes. because of the moisture there is no bounce so playing in the v will be a safer option okay so till now you have given two points playing close to the body and playing in the v anything else related to your stance or your back lift Will you either of the adjustment? Will you do uh, for stance? You have to stay low, little bit lower. Yes. And what about the back lift in case the ball is skidding through, keeping low, high or medium, medium, low, medium back lift? Because you will have lesser time in case the ball quickly yes. slides. Okay. So perfect. Well done. So for this situation, la, we'll play some balls. So let's see how it goes. Yes. Okay. Simple. Follow the three points that you said. Close to the body. Play in yes. the V. little bit adjustment in stance and back lift